The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Now, this former indie star was part of tag teams and formed some strong bonds before WWE. After training with Booker T, she learned the most important thing to focus on is herself. For her, business is business, and whoever steps in her way is going down. She's been training for this match for quite a while, and she plans on making a statement here tonight. Here comes the queen, the franchise, and the self-proclaimed opportunity. And from the Queen City, Charlotte Flair! You know, the WWE Universe, at least many in it, believe that she's been handed title opportunities in main events. Well, many of those same doubters live in their parents' basements, Cole. I wouldn't necessarily value their opinion. This is Charlotte Flair. This is the queen. This is the opportunity. So, Byron, from your parents' basement, what do you feel about Charlotte Flair? First of all, I moved out last week, Michael. And second of all, I do think Charlotte's ego can be a bit out of control at times. After everything Charlotte Flair has accomplished in her career, her ego is allowed to be as big as it possibly can be. She's got an amazing robe. Saxton, how have you not learned by now? You need to open the ropes for the queen. Corey, haven't you heard? I'm no longer on robe duty. Oh, I didn't get that memo. Ladies and gentlemen, the first ever Queen of the Ring tournament has all led to this dramatic conclusion. WWE's self-proclaimed queen is defending her crown against a superstar who is limping into the finals courtesy of an attack from none other than her opponent, Charlotte Flair. Only one of these two superstars can walk or limp out of this match as official WWE royalty. My advice for the challenger, if you come at the queen, you best not miss. Yes, press! Short clothesline, not finished yet. Another? Yes, two! Trifecta! Damaging blow. She has her target weighed and measured. Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Quickly slips behind. German suplex. She's forced onto the defensive now. Malicious fallaway slam. A consistent attack being mounted on Flair. The Queen's perseverance being tested here. Under the rope she goes. She shoots up the top rope. Dangerous thinking. She begins to stir back up, but does it look good? From the top. Wow! For the win. Quick count out after one. She just will not give up, Cole. Stops the kick into a dragon screw. Game changer. Oh, and she got out of there. Neck breaker. There it 
comes. Neck breaker. That could be it. Able to sidestep it. Miss Wildly, this could pick up the win here. I can't make sense of that decision. She might have had the pinfall in hand. Caught with a clothesline. Things not going how she'd like. There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. To the sky. She knows exactly what she's doing with this submission hold. She's got it locked in. No, she doesn't. That was a great counter and so simple. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Planted with the Bulldog. An overbearing assault on Charlotte now. Charlotte needs to find a way to reverse her fortunes. She had her right where she wanted her. She doesn't want the suffering to end, that's why. From the top! Nobody home for that one. Big form. What a counter. Charlotte showing how much punishment she can withstand before dishing out some of her own. The U-turn Charlotte needed in this match could have been that right there. She must be close to finish now. figure eight no way at all i think you might be mistaken saxton Charlotte with the boot strong elbow to the crown Places are right in the corner. This has been such a back and forth matchup. She looks like she's willing to do anything to end this thing. She may have to. These two have battled back and forth, thrown everything they have at one another. But what on earth is next? Steadily climbing. What could she possibly be thinking? All the way to the top! Oh! She wants to put an end to things here. Uh-oh. Oh, man, into the neck breaker. Oh. Flair couldn't avoid it. There she is, your first ever queen of the ring. She wasn't 100% after Charlotte's attack and yet still managed to win the crown here tonight. Just a gutsy performance overall. And this has to be a major blow to Charlotte's ego. The self-proclaimed queen now has to share the title with someone who beat her for it in the middle of the ring. Charlotte's feelings aside, what a night for our new queen of the ring.